super size drip with three sugars. You definitely need to eat something. I'm not driving back to Rosewood with low blood sugar, Spencer. That's worse than no caffeine, Spencer. Wow, your girlfriend sounds awesome. It's really not. It's a photo op for the candidate's children. We're starving. OK, well, I'll make you some eggs. Uh, do you want some toast? Oh my god, please. Burnt? That's the only way I make it. Easy on the coffee, Spence. Your hand's already shaking. Are you kidding? Spencer bleeds caffeine. <sighs> that way, if anybody goes next door, we'll be able to hear them through the wall. Caffeine? Well, I think you've had enough. I just need you to promise me one thing. OK. I will always get the first cup of coffee in the morning. <laughs> Spencer, I promise I will not come between you and your relationship with caffeine. Thank you. Housekeeping. An hour ago, studies and litigation all day. Yeah. We need caffeine. Oh, no offense, but can I make it? Seriously? I'm with Aria. Yeah, sorry, Spence, but your coffee gives me the shakes. Amateurs. Yelling, yelling. Slow down, I haven't had coffee. I just wanted to drink it, not swim laps. Well, apparently you. Is there any more coffee? Ah, uh, it goes against my better judgment. But this is your last cup, okay? Thomas. All right. You get on Mrs. Ackert's good side, and no one in town would. Why do I need to be on her good side? Because 